boys and girls. Now today we are learning about sharing. Now sharing is when we take a bigger group of objects and divide it or share it into smaller groups. Now we have to remember when we share it must be fair. Let's give it a go. Okay, I've got four tasty marshmallows here that I'm going to share with my friend. So I've got one plate for me and one plate for my friend. Let's start sharing. One for me, one for my friend, one for me, and one for my friend. Is that fair? Do we both have the same number? Yes, that is fair sharing because I have two marshmallows and my friend has two marshmallows. We both have the same number. Let's try another number. Now I have six marshmallows. I'm going to share these six marshmallows between the two groups. Let's go. One for me, one for my friend. One for me, one for my friend. One for me. And one for my friend. Is that fair sharing? Do we both have the same number? Yes. I have a group of three and my friend has a group of three. That is fair sharing. Now I have nine chocolate Smarties to share. Hmm. Do you think I'll be able to share them fairly? Let's see what happens. One for me, one for my friend. One for me, one for my friend. One for me, one for my friend. One for me. One for my friend. Hmm. One for me? Hmm. How many Smarties do I have? Let's count. One, two, three, four, five. How many does my friend have? One, two, three, four. Oh dear. Is that fair? No, that is not fair sharing. I think I should take one away from my plate. Okay, so now I have four Smarties and my friend has four Smarties. There is one Smartie left over. So sometimes, boys and girls, when we share a number, it doesn't share fairly. And sometimes we have what's called a leftover. Okay, now boys and girls, I'm going to share 10 Smarties between myself and my friend. Now, instead of counting out 10 Smarties beforehand, I'm just going to count to 10 while sharing. That's another strategy that you can use. Let's start sharing. One, two, Okay, I have shared 10 Smarties between myself and my friend. Let's count to see how many we have each. One, two, three, four, five for me. One, two, three, four, five for my friend. Is that fair sharing? Yes. So 10 shared into two is five. So to summarise, when we share, each group needs to have the same number. You can practice sharing between two groups, three groups, or four groups. If you have one remaining, that is called the leftover. Happy sharing!